Hello to the woman in the fourth row texting that's just turned her phone off. Hi! You're right. I can just see your fucking face illuminated by your phone as you're there googling Mac makeup or whatever. Chill out. It's. It's. What, sorry? Poundland. Well, I quite like her, to be honest with you. There's something about, there's something about like, where you go stop giggling. She's like, I am scum. I, I quite like it. I like you. It's all right, mate. It's all right. Uh, uh, so, hello to you, newbies. Uh, uh, what's, what's your name, mate? Chris. Chris. Everyone say hi, Chris. Hi, Chris. There's a lot of love for you, Chris. You seem like a nice bloke. Um, that ch- shirt is a bit of a fucking choice, isn't it, pal? That's, <laughs> that's insane. It look, well, he's got a lot going. I couldn't wear it because it would show off my fucking cleavage, mate. It's a... Um, <laughs> I'd be a D cup in that. This gorgeous, mate. Where did you get that shirt from? I like it. I have no idea. You what, sorry? I have no idea. You've no idea. Who got it? Me, probably. You got it, but you can't remember where it's from. Ipswich. It's a little shop in Ipswich, and I wouldn't know what it is, because it's just so boutique and bohemian <laughs> that you would not possibly even understand. It was, it was when I was listening to my friend's band that are really big now, but I was into them at the very beginning. <laughs> um, that's sweet, man. That's all right. That's cool. Are you from Ipswich, then? Cool. What's taking you over here then? How come you? How come you? Uh, her. Oh, hello to no, you. Her. Just uh. Yeah. What? Family. Family. Why is everything that you say a fucking riddle? What's? <laughs> what's the fucking riddler from Ipswich? <laughs> Just <laughs> throwing out rhymes and shit. Um, where did you get this shirt from? <laughs> You'll have to find out. <laughs> I like you, mate, but you're hard to speak to, aren't you? Um, so cool. So, so, so you've come from Ipswich for over here for just for a weekend, just for cool, good stuff. And uh, is, is this your lovely uh, girlfriend, wife, partner? Wife. Wife. Good stuff. How long have you been together for? Five years. Five years. Nice. How did you meet? <laughs> oh, now there's a fucking story behind that. Uh, Freddie, we actually met at a really boutique little cafe. You wouldn't have heard of it. You know, it's really on the down, though. Oh, my God. See, you two won't understand that reference because you came late. That's your punishment. I'm going to do callbacks to the bit that you fucking missed. And next time, you'll get here on time, won't you? Mmm. Poundland makeup. What? Um, so, <laughs> so, uh, so, how did you meet? What happened? I was a taxi driver. You were a taxi driver? Oh, I think I've seen a porn film about this. <laughs> Is this that fake taxi thing where they drive round and she goes, I haven't got any money. You go, well, you can suck my fucking dick, darling. <laughs> and while you're at it, where did you get that top? Because I like the fucking looks of it. Um, sweet. All right, so you, so you were a taxi driver um, that's, and you were a, uh, a, a passenger. Okay. And then you struck up a conversation and... Right, this is important, I think. Where were you ferrying her from and to? Because if it's like... You know, I was coming back from the train station, you know, then that's kind of, I guess that's kind of romantic. But if it's like, it was four in the morning and I was pissed and I'd shit myself, then it's like, <laughs> the romance gets taken away somewhat. So what was, what was happening? Where, where were you going from and to? It was from work to her home. It was from work to her home. Oh, okay. What do you do? What do you do work-wise? A, a pub called The Fat Cat. Oh, I know The Fat Cat. Not really. I don't know fucking anything in Ipswich. <laughs> Because it's so boutique. Um, cool, all right. So, so you took her home, then you got her chatting, and then you're together. That's a fucking great story. You still a cabbie? No, you gave it up. Get paranoid. What with people talking behind your back. Thank you! <laughs> Did you see me fucking crowbar that in then? Really tried to fit it in. You, you, you didn't help me at all. You was like, what? What are you doing, dickhead? Um, cool. All right. Uh, it makes me laugh doing things that are shit. That's uh, why I do comedy. <laughs> so, um, uh, so, what do you do now, mate? What, what, what you up to? Uh, I'm in construction. You're in construction? So what, what, what stuff do you build? Uh, extensions, conservatories. Extensions and conservatories and new builds. Is it for your own company or for somebody else's? Oh, that's a fucking shame, isn't it, mate? Cool. <laughs> have you got have you got a conservatory and an extension shit on your house? No. <laughs> never never thought about taking your work home with you. Not <laughs> not even once. I like you two. I hope you two have a nice night.